Fix FaceTime lagging on iPhone iPad with these 7 ways. Check the FaceTime server. The first thing you should do is to check the FaceTime server. For the app to work, the server needs to be active. Otherwise, there's nothing you can do to fix it but wait until Apple deals with the problem. Disable low power mode. Open the settings app. Tap on battery. Next to low power mode, toggle the switch to disable the feature. This option is available only on iPhones. Restart your iOS device. Restarting your device will close all apps. Even the ones that are running in the background that you forgot to close. This step will optimize your iPhone slash iPad and give it a fresh start. Re-download FaceTime app. Tap and hold the FaceTime app until a quick menu pops up. Tap on delete app and confirm the action by tapping on delete. Now, go to the app store. In the search field, enter FaceTime. Next to the app name, tap on the cloud with an arrow icon to re-download it. Wait for the FaceTime app to finish downloading and open the app to start a call. Clear out storage. Open the settings app. Go to general settings. Then tap on storage. You'll see how much storage space is left and what kind of items are taking the most space. Delete unnecessary items. Reset all settings. Open the settings app. Tap on general. Scroll to the bottom and tap on reset. Then select reset all settings. Enter your device passcode and confirm the action. Update iOS. Open the settings app. Go to the general settings. Tap on software update. Wait while your device searches for updates. If found any, tap on download and install. Hopefully, this video provided the information you were looking for. If you're using a Mac computer, we would like to suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. It will check your computer for malicious software infections and advertising supported software. The disk cleaner option will scan your computer for app caches, logs, downloaded files, and files still sitting in the trash. It will also show you how much space what files to take up on your Mac. Combo Cleaner will also help you look through all big files on your Mac and delete those you don't need. You can also scan Mac for duplicate files. Sometimes you might not know that you have a few copies of the same file. A privacy scanner that will help you remove cookies, cache, browse history and more and an app uninstaller that will find all hidden app components and uninstall them for you. You won't need to worry about viruses and clutter on your Mac anymore. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.